COVID-19 pandemic grew, Baptist Hospital created teams within its facility to help find some solutions. And one of the biggest challenges was having enough N95 masks for those on the front lines. The team found a way to recycle the masks they are using, and they say it's very safe. On your side's Ken Amaria shows you how that works. Ken? The coronavirus pandemic pulled back the mask on a problem within the healthcare industry. The insufficient number of PPEs, or uh, personal protection equipment, but here at Baptist Hospital, they're now using advanced technology to recycle the N95 mask used by healthcare workers. The zapping sound that you're hearing is coming from a robot using ultraviolet light to decontaminate each mask. How many masks are we talking about, Katie? We've done well over a thousand masks. Katie Dorsey, nursing director at Baptist Beaches Medical Center, was on the team that was challenged to find solutions. We are doing two five-minute cycles uh, with the robot, and that cleans the front and then the back of our team member masks. She says the hospital has been using the robots since 2014 to clean operating rooms and patients' rooms. Where was the connection made as far as face masks? Dorsey says they reached out to Xenix, the manufacturer, and they were ready. So they provided us with a lot of science behind, behind our new protocol. Baptist is now the first hospital in the region to use the Xenex disinfection services to meet their need to help those on the front line in the fight against COVID-19. You know, we're doing all we can to help. We're really proud of our frontline team members and we want to do all we can to support them. We really want to capture as many of our N95s as possible. So far, the technology is working and will be rolled out to the other Baptist campuses and then to the freestanding facilities and eventually through the entire system. Canamero, First Coast News, on your side.